Eight rules to master your presence and influence one. Mirror in their eyes. When you converse with someone, seek the reflection of your own spirit in their gaze. It's not just about looking imposing. It's about connecting powerfully. 2. Command attention. Truly listen when others speak. When it's your turn, speak with such conviction that the world pauses to listen. 3. Oasis of calm. In the whirlwind of chaos, be the calm. Your clear, composed mind will naturally elevate you above the storm. 4. Silent strength. If insulted, respond not with words, but with a poised gaze. Let your silence broadcast your resilience and depth. 5. Smile with your soul. Let your eyes smile brighter than your lips. A genuine spark in your gaze can transform hearts. 6. Power in pause. Never rush to reply. Embrace a thoughtful pause. Deliberate responses hold immense power. 7. Posture of confidence. Walk tall with your shoulders back and your spine straight. Show the world that you move with purpose and ease. 8. Slow your words. Speak deliberately. A slow, confident cadence isn't just heard, it's felt. Remember, influence isn't claimed, it's cultivated. Embody these principles and watch your presence become both unmistakable and inspirational. If you've absorbed these insights, comment with 100. Your journey to influence starts now. By age 30, you should be smart enough to realize this. 1. Stay silent. Not everything needs to be said. 2. Silence is better than unnecessary drama. 3. If you find someone smarter than you, work with them. Don't compete. Competition is weakness. 4. The family you create is more important than the family you come from. 5. Your current job doesn't care about you. They only pay you enough to kill your dreams. 9. Free yourself from the society's advice. Most of them have no idea of what they're doing. 10. It's better to have one friend who's happy for you, supports your win, encourages your dreams, than a bunch of acquaintance who are lazy, self-centered, jealous of your success. 11. You'll be ten times happier if you forgive your parents and stop blaming them. 12. If you continue waiting for the right time, you'll waste your whole life and nothing will happen. 13. No one will ever come save you. Your life is 100% your responsibility. 14. Your inner circle should be more focused on money, success, and starting a family. You don't need a hundred self-help books. All you need is actions and self-discipline and to follow me. Remember, if you're seeking to elevate your mindset, relationships, and health, listen to Goggins. Accelerate your journey and unlock new levels of success and fulfillment. I think the most masculine men have the courage to love. And I think men who are insecure, who are hollow in their masculinity, want to be worshipped. But men who are rich and mature in their manhood know the power of loving. It's different than wanting to be loved. It's actually having the courage to love. Here's my advice to you today. Walk away from the 97%. Don't talk like they talk. Don't act like they act. Don't go where they go. Don't specialize in what they specialize in. Throw away the blameless they cling to. Start you a new life. Switch gears. Switch language. Switch ideas. Switch strategy. Start with the simplest of disciplines and don't be mean any of these disciplines. The smallest of disciplines starts the process of life change. And if you'll invest in this thing called business, you can have whatever you wish. It's called the beginning of miracles.